Hi, everybody. This is Emma. Most of you know Emma. <laughs> You've seen her at recess. She is my assistant today because I realize she's much cuter than I am at this point um, in the day. <laughs> so she is going to share with you our morning um, nursery rhyme poem that we usually do to start off our reading. And we're going to start with the title. It is Mary, Mary, Quite Contrary. So some of you have probably heard this before. Let's go ahead and read it. Mary, Mary, Quite Contrary. How does your garden grow with silver bells and cockle shells and pretty maids all in a row? So if we were in our classroom, I would say, what did you hear when I was reading this? And I bet you heard something with those words. There were two words that sounded very similar or very much the same. Emma, can you figure out what they were? Silver bells and cockle shells? No. Mary, Mary, quite contrary, how does your garden grow with silver bells and cockle grow shells and, and pretty maids all in a row? So grow and row. Can you point to grow? Grow, grow row. And what's special about those, Emma? Grow, row. Yep, they rhyme. Good. So we're going to be reading this week when we read yesterday Oscar and the Frog. Oops. <laughs> Turning on some sound effects over here. Oh, jeepers. Just press it twice. <laughs> Hold on, friends. Sorry about that. I'm leaning on a dollhouse. Um, when we were reading Oscar and the Frog, that was all about animals and the life cycle. So this week we are learning about plants and animals and living things. So our next story that we're going to be reading that I'm probably going to share with you guys tomorrow is about um, Zinnia's flower garden. So I think you'll really like that. All right, stay tuned. We're going to do some of our new sight words for the week. Bye. Say bye, Emma.